Hi, I'm Steve. And I'm Tim. We're with Trans Chicago Truck Group. Your authorized Freightliner and Western Star dealership. We have a new model year 21 Freightliner Cascadia here, and we're going to try some new technologies. The first one being active lane assist. All right, Steve, let's go for a ride. So the Detroit Assurance 5.0 is basically Daimler's suite of safety systems. And what we want to show today is active lane assist. But active lane assist is built on lane departure warning. So, Tim, when you get a chance, explain what lane departure warning is and, and how it works. Demonstrate it. So lane departure warning is a system that if I go to advertently or inadvertently leave my lane without using my turn signal, it's going to alert me with an audible sound. So we'll try it right now. And there you go. I did not use my turn signal. Uh, the system would have assumed that I was drifting out of my lane and it wanted to warn me to get back into my lane. And that's what it did. Now I notice when you go to the left side, the left speaker makes a rumble sound noise. Yes. If you go to the right, you're going to get that same sound out of the right speaker, right? Correct. Yep. That's exactly right, Steve. Simple enough. Uh, now, on top of this, we have something called active lane assist. And there's two pieces of active lane assist. And the first part is lane keep assist. Tim, is that active right now? It is. It is. I can feel it um, uh, moving the steering wheel in my hands. Uh, I don't know if you can see a slight movement of the steering wheel. I've taken my hands off but the steering wheel is moving left and right to keep me centered in the lane. What happens if you take your hands off the wheel for too long? Uh, we'll get an, uh, an alert at 30 seconds and a yellow signal will come up on the dashboard that lets me know it's a caution signal. And then uh, later on into the uh, caution it'll go red, it start beeping, and eventually it will turn the system off at about a minute or a little over a minute. Go for one up to show that to us? Yeah, sure. So I'll take my hands off now completely and we'll wait for the 30 seconds. I do want to point out this is nothing we recommend, but obviously everybody's going to try it sooner or later. But it is a assistance. It's nothing to, it's not a hands free system. So there's the yellow caution come up and it says hands on. It's telling me to put my hands back on the wheel. And now in another maybe 20 seconds or so here start to see a red and a, a, there's the audible alert. That'll come every five seconds in the beginning. On 55 seconds that'll be a solid alarm? Yes. Or every one second. So now we're into the situation where it'll turn itself off. Now it's solid. So there we go. I'll, I'll grab it. And now we're back in control. The red light has gone off. And now we've got our blue, uh, our hands are on the wheel and the system is in control still. So uh, we're good to continue. The whole time you're doing this, Tim, it's also active. Uh, adaptive cruise control is active as well, right? It, exactly, yeah. So we're spacing ourselves. We've got it set at 65 and we're keeping a 3.4 second distance from the vehicle in front of us. So the whole time you've never had to touch the accelerator, no. the resume switch, anything like that? No, no, feet, feet have not touched any of the pedals. Now it also has lane departure protection. Uh, and I understand it's supposed to steer you back into the lane should you run out too far, right? Is that something we can demonstrate with the traffic we have here? Yeah, yeah, we sure can. So if I don't use my turn signal and I start to move the truck a little bit out of my lane to the left, I'm going to the left, we get the audible alert and it steers us back into our lane. So it centered us back up, put us back in our lane. Tim, one thing I, uh, you know, as a driver myself that I Curiosity is killing me. What happens now if you turn off the seatbelt? Certainly, it's something we don't really want to encourage anybody to do, but inevitably, everybody's going to want to try to test this. So, let's give it a try. I'll take my seatbelt off, and my hands are not on. We're going around the curve in the road here on the highway. The audible alert is only for the seatbelt. I've got a flashing seatbelt light, so that's gone off, and the system is still active. 
So it's still steering, it's still maintaining my distance from the vehicle in front of me. We've got our caution come up now to tell me that I'm not having my hands on the wheel. So I'll grab the wheel again and take over, but the system does remain active with the seatbelt off. You just did exactly what nobody wants you to do. Yes, but it, it, it did continue to work. And it's continuing to work too while I have both hands putting the seatbelt back on, which is not recommended either, but it kept me where I needed to be and I was able to reconnect my seatbelt and we stayed in our lane. I can see where this could be a lifesaver in those small interruptions and take your eyes off the road for a couple of seconds and the unexpected happens. Exactly. We all get distracted for one reason or another and we probably all learned the same thing in driver's ed when we were teenagers. When you're looking to the left, you're going to steer to the left and if you're looking to the right, you're going to steer to the right. And this system takes that out of the, uh, out of the equation. This is a production option, so this is a fully production truck. It's not a test truck yes. or anything like that. It's a, available today. Yes, every, it's every, yeah, every fully proven and tested technology. Yep, everything we're driving today is available. You can give us a call, and we can place an order for one. And we do have several in stock that you could have immediately if uh, if you needed a truck right now. And if you want to come out and try it for yourself to see how it works, we'd love to see you then too. Tim, the cost on this option, when you include the lane departure warning, you add the active lane assist, which is the lane departure protection, the lane keep, um, the cost on that is $3,100, and that includes federal excise tax. That is your, your final price due for this kind of technology. When you look at that over the course of a four or five year ownership period, it's a small price to pay for the safety it brings, and also for the driver fatigue factor. It's a lot less stress on a driver when he's not having to manage um, the throttle every second. He can keep his feet flat on the ground, and also it helps you with crosswinds and uh, other distractions that may take you slightly out of your lane. So it's, I think it's worth every penny, especially over the long haul. It prevents that one incident that you never know happened. It's paid for. Right. Same, same with any of the pieces of the uh, Detroit Assurance 5.0. Thanks for joining us today. We'd love for you to come out and get one of these trucks yourself. Try the technology out for yourself. Get hold of us. Let us know what you think. We'd love to see you. Thanks again. Look forward to seeing you.